Yeah, it was just an awkward thing that happened last game. Oh, holy moly! I don't know about this one. Oh, please, 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 please. Now that Brom got nerfed, he's actually not too good anymore. Um, the, the one thing that I, you end up doing on a lot of melee champs made that start flask is you end up <coughs> going back for the next board, or the next pot. So you sit here for like five pots, uh, and you sit at the very edge of the buying uh, the shop buy, which is like over here. Over here. Let's over here. Okay. You'll find out in a little bit. Man. Alright, well, <laughs> a little bit too far out. Um, yeah, the, so ideally you get the fifth, the fourth pot, and you get the lane before any creeps die. So something like this is very common. So I can already tell clicking him that he started uh, E, so it's going to be extremely hard for me to actually push him for anything. I'm just going to let myself get pushed in, and just try to get some CS as I can. I'll try to thin the wave if she lets me, but... That's fine. That's fine. I just eat for CS actually, which is a little bit strange because that doesn't really happen much. But wow. Okay, a level two gank bot lane. But there was also a reverse gank bot lane and the reverse double kill. Okay, not sounding too good. Okay, <laughs> definitely not sounding too good. That's actually such a problem. Luckily I'm playing Fizz, so when I'm playing against stuff like that, it's not a huge deal. I didn't get out. I took a really bad trade. I thought I was going to hit 3 before her, but I needed one more creep for 3. And so because of that, my trade was just terrible. And this sucks because I need jungle pressure to be able to put, be put mid, so I can actually win this lane. Actually, the juggler is looking mid right now, which is really good for me. No, no, he's not. <laughs> okay, well, he tried to look at mid at least. At least there's some sort of jungle pressure. I feel like that's really, really good. At least Lee can get his second buff. That's the that's the one thing I'm happy about. Got three autos. Uh, if Lee went a better route, like I actually won that trade solo. Well, I don't know what Lee's doing. They won't catch me. I still have a lot of health pots remaining. Um, I think she's out of both. Uh, what's the CS look like? Seventeen to twenty-four. Uh, I don't think he should be here because it's like. Took whatever to be honest. Just gonna farm. Kind of waiting for my mana to to slowly rise up. Uh, and I'm not in too big of a hurry to look to trade right now, mainly because my mana pool doesn't won't allow me to trade. I'm a little bit behind in, in XP as well because Lee Sin took my XP when he came in for both the ganks. So she's just letting me farm for free, which is ideal. Like I don't, I don't care. Like I, I would love to be able to kill her, but I mean that time is pretty much past. I just don't have the ability to do that right now. That has a lot of autos actually. Holy shit. She suddenly started playing aggro around level 5. I don't know if she thinks that's her power spike. Yeah. 
I don't know if I should have flashed that. Lee can my lane super hard though. If he hits six of the ulti me, I would just be dead. Oh god, I was so scared of that. Just gonna back out here. Oh, the large rod buy is so tempting here. I don't have a large rod though. Oh, I have enough gold for it, so I just have to wait. It sucks, man. It just sucks. Does he have this? I just warning my team that a uh, global is up, which is what you should always look to do. Swimming. All the words I'm gonna place on the sides aren't gonna matter. Okay, well she hit six. I went to try to go on her before six, but looks like it's not very possible. Please stop bothering me. I think she max Q first. I'm unsure though. She max Q first. I can tell by the CDR. Wow, she played right into my hands. There's no... I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh my god. I should have eat. Oh my god, I eat for the see us. Oh, oh well. Nice, nice, nice. I got the assist gold too. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I love gold. Alright, we'll probably buy the CDR. I don't really think I need boots. So, her barriers can come up around the same time that my Ignite comes up. The reason why I was really happy why she Shockwave, because Shockwave is typically used to like put distance on me. Like, she should be trying to kite me and auto aim me while her cooldowns are, like, while she's waiting for her Q to come back up. But she Shockwave me into her, and I was like, uh, okay, I'll take it. Like it's something that's just like, okay, free kill. Yeah, so you see, I only got hit with one portion there. Ow. Oh my god, I wasn't able to get the sheen proc there. Unfortunate. Oh no, he he scared her away. Oh my god, I get solo kill this person. Please, just let me kill her. Uh, I don't know if I can kill her anymore. She's really, really farmed. Well, not farmed, really healthy. So, Fizz has a naturally large range. I, uh, I meant to do something different. Go ahead and pink this. Ooh. I really uh yeah no one saw that you really can't jump okay well oh well, the reason why I also buy sheen Please run, 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 please run. The reason why I buy Sheen is, is because Sheen is, uh, does just physical damage. So it lets me actually go through Chalice Rush champions. Like, where did he go? Because I just backed. If he killed my ally there, I apologize. Okay. Man, I lost so much for that roam. Uh, not only did I lose a lot of CS, but I lost 
Like, a let mid catch up. Never too good. You see how she used it that time? The way the, the way that was used made, makes it so it's not possible for me to get it. Because she knocked me backwards with her shockwave. And, and I already used my gap closers. Now, had I flashed the uh, shockwave, there would have been a, a strong chance I would have picked up the kill. But I wasn't even sure if I could get the kill with her having barrier. However, she barriered there, me, I'm 100% guaranteed the kill next time. I feel like I should just back. Just because I need mana. I backed late though, that was really bad. So she's gonna just shove it all the way in. Uh, I just hope I don't lose turn here. Might lose her right here, I don't know. She had no barrier there, so it's pretty much guaranteed. I don't care if there's a, they have a fed AD carry. Uh, one of the biggest counters to the to, to fed Twitch actually is uh, is uh, what should we call it, Fizz? Because he every like typically him being a mobile is fine if you have some sort of peel, but you really it's really hard for you to peel off a zigzag and kill you one hit, literally one hit. See, I hate this. I keep going back up, back on bad gold values. I wish I, man, I, I, I just want a 1600 gold back, please. Only buy three Dorans. Seven. Should probably come and take that blue pretty soon, but. She still got a 13 minute grail, that's not even that bad. I'm just gonna go solo blue then. Er, okay. He asked if I could solo blue and then immediately... That's something like this. Perfect. Oh! Hello! It's really good. My mid lane turret's gone, but that's fine. I'll take all these kills for these mid lane turrets. Imagine if, if it's like I have enough gold for probably a BFG. Imagine if I actually got that rather than all these like random assorted items. It's really annoying. Right now I'm trying to shove. I mean, it's kind of playing like it doesn't respect the uh, yeah like like the junglers here. Oh god, this is going to be a very close, close battle. Never mind, they're, they're not able to rotate faster than us. Okay. This is a little bit dangerous. Oh god, this is, this is really bad. This is not something we should be fighting, in other words. And... I just wanted to chuck him a little bit, I didn't want to actually go in on him. I should have said something, that was... Like, that was such a bait by me for him. I can understand the need to just like follow up, like if your teammates like your teammates do something, you're just like, wow, this guy must know what he's doing. Like, let me just let me just help him. And a lot of times, like, wait, so he's just me to die. 
What the heck? What am I watching? If he has this, yo, go. What the? F he had it. Oh my god. That's actually pretty good. She's really good. Ooh, is that the Juke Master? Can we like fight this? Hello, team? Holy shit. Where's the other guy? Where did the the Twitch go? Oh, we got we got juice. Did someone DC? Where are all my okay no, he's still here. They go back for a DFG now. Ooh, this is a nice look. But he saw it. Ooh, he's dead. Oh, Ooh. that looks really bad, actually. Oh boy. If Brown's still in the area, I want to go in on this champ, but. She knows. She knows. Okay. As soon as she stutters that back and forth, I knew she knew that I was there. There's no reason anyone would ever do that unless action immediately started happening in lane. Or bot lane. The game is still really close. A lot of the kills are just on the city. I'm surprised he's actually able to recover from uh, such a devastating early game. Wow, he's level. Nine. Yes, we are fairly far behind in bot lane. I did not realize. So yeah. Again, I'm playing a champ that's very friendly uh, against Twitch. Please, I need mana. Oh my god. Holy shit, I missed my E. Oh boy. Wow. You got a lot for that. That one. That was really good though by her. Your team has destroyed a turret. Mm. An enemy on, has been slain. Your team has destroyed a turret. Huh. I, although I haven't been able to show it yet, though, I'd really like to be able to show exactly how you secure uh, fishes on, on enemy players. Because honestly, my fizz game was terrible until I learned that you could actually do this. Um, it, pretty much what happens is when you throw your Q, when you Q someone, you're guaranteed to fish at the same time. 
Do you throw your fish while in midair on of your Q? So literally, as you're jumping to the person, you throw a fish. So this will look pretty greedy of me, but you know what? I, I'm a pretty greedy person. Uh, and pretty much, it me like I, a lot of people try to bait fish, like they want to flash it because there's a long travel time. And in my mind, I was like, yeah, you know what? Fish maybe not be that good, even though look at this, look at this thing, hundred mana for like 325 base that that slows them as well as knocks them up. Like it does does a, a, it does everything for you. Might as well cook you breakfast too. Like it's so good, but applying it has always been the hard part of playing this champion. And then I realized you could be Q, kill D, and it's like, okay, well, everything, everything works out easier now. So after that, now that was just down to you just playing the champion. This is a free bot lane turret, I'm gonna keep going. I think I'm gonna start running up now. Ooh, no, 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 I'm gonna keep going. Dive, 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 dive. Anyone who's here, just dive it. one lich main with w I'm pushing in mid and bot se second right now oh twitch just killed it right ooh mid still alive okay I could just flash and kill them don't think it was worth it though What? Your turret has been destroyed. I could definitely kill that one though. Holy sh! Oh well, or he's here. That's why he was so ambitious. Hmm. So Ori actually has a lot of CS. Or is like my major my major problem this game with Nocturne. I should try to kill these. I'm just dancing around and stuff. I really want to get the uh, sixteen hundred gold before I back. Cause I really don't think I need armor. I, I do need Zanias, but at least right now I don't think it, it's that necessary. That was a really, really good exhaust though. Uh, I just need to run. Ooh! The the flank! And it does nothing, because Lucian's like 1 in 4. 1 in 5 or something like that. But it's fine. We got everything that we needed there. That was a really... I, I expected to trade like 2 for 2. But we traded even better because we only got a really good exhaust there. Five. Double buffs on Fizz. Oh my god, the slaughter right here. It's about to begin. Okay, so what you do now is you just time. Please. Oh my god. 
Oh, uh, I was too ambitious there. Oh, he still had heal? Oh my god. Oh god, that would have been so good. Well, fortunately stuff doesn't always go your way. I should've just went back. Not a big deal. I don't know what if he was in range. We lost drag for that too. Uh, unfortunate. No. Let's go. Just, oh, we need. We haven't lost. We haven't lost drag. This is so important to get actually. We'll trade, we'll trade at least one. Oh my god! He couldn't get it. It's a free bear. That's definitely free. Yeah, Harry Ops played that super well. Unfortunately, my fish missed, you know? I'm trying to keep at the very max range of my attack range. Um... Yeah, I, I prefer to shop right now. I have my Zhonya's and then my blue pot. So I've hit my core right now. Obviously I would like to get like Void or Death Cap, but everything else is pretty luxury at the moment. Ten, three, seven. okay. I'm actually surprised Ori... Ori feels like she's the most relevant player. Um, but, like, looking at the score, she she's so far behind. My fish didn't even pop up. Who, who took it? Uh, well, he died instantly. Like, I didn't even pop my blue pot, so I was like, okay, we'll have a free kill. No, he just died so fast. Pop my blue pot here. For better tower shoving. I'm down, I'm down! Oh my god, the Ori shield! Oh, okay, wait, he didn't get it. I think he's dead. Oh my god, that was warded! I even got the Q, the Q ulti correct there. 
Oh my god. Uh, fine. Whatever. Twitch just got me. I'll give him that one. So, one, two MR items. Oh god. So I could have a really big buy here. Um, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and go for the void staff buy. Uh, it'd actually be really nice now. I'm gonna get the void. I'm just gonna go ahead and pick up, wait for this void, and then go for a blue buff. I do enough damage to just like literally circumvent their whole team and kill their back line. So like, what makes it so hard for Twitch's look? I have two. I have two invulnerable. Like I flash in a vulnerable gap closer, and then like another gap closer on top of that. That with combined with uh, Q ulti, Q E ulti, and Deathfire grass can one shot the guy even if he has MR. And Twitch has to build damage, especially when you're behind. So he just has to hope he outpositions me, which just seems like very. Uh, that's like okay, well. If that's all he asked for him, and with with against the champ with this many gap closures, I wouldn't put my money on Twitch ever. In a flash. Okay, okay, move up a little bit. Kill him before my ulti goes off. That's really good. Yep. Like I said, even with hitting the best Oriole I've seen this game, it's still really, really hard for them to come back. Like that was an insane Oriole. Hit four people, I was in Zion so I, I would have gotten hit too. And when you get that kind of Oriole, that's like a game winning Oriole. It would have been if I hadn't been able to gap close. Uh, I'm gonna go get some more water guys, I'll be right back. 